Hey guys, welcome to the DMX Show. I'm your host Shane, and today I'm going to show you guys how to unlock the bootloader and install a custom Clockwork Mod Recovery uh, for your Asus Transformer Prime. Uh, what this is good for is uh, you'll be able to flash all sorts of modifications to the tablet and also put on custom ROMs and user interfaces uh, to provide for an even snappier um, more enhanced use of your Asus Transformer Prime. This is going to make things quicker and also give you tons of customization options for theming and the like. So we'll go ahead and jump right in. This would be really quick and easy and should take us pretty much no time at all. So what you want to do is head on over to the link in the description and you'll be looking for um, you'll be looking for this Viper Mod. I'm sorry, yeah, Viper Mod Root Toolkit. It would be called uh, Prime Time. And you want to download that here if you have Windows or if you have Linux. You just download that. It'll give you a zip file. Of course, you'll unzip it. If you follow my root guide, you already have it installed. And of course, you will have to be rooted prior to installing uh, the Unlock Bootloader and Clockwork Mod Recovery. So once you have all that together, uh, you'll just open up the toolkit. And on your Prime, go ahead and connect that to the PC. You need to have your drivers installed. You should already have them installed if you're rooted. If not, it includes the drivers in the toolkit there. Uh, so we'll just set this up here. And all we have to do is choose option number five. Let me get it. Uh, yep, all we have to do is choose option number five. This is you must install the ASUS drivers package, which we already have. And this is press any key to continue. So we'll press any key. And USB debugging must be checked. So to get USB debugging checked, you'll open up your settings. And you'll scroll to developer options. You should already know how to do this if you're rooted. And then just make sure that that box is checked. So we are there. We should be ready to go. Uh, so we'll press any key to continue. And so now it has begun its process. We'll give it a few minutes. It's going to go ahead and unlock the bootloader. It says, please find the unlock tool in your app drawer and run it. The device will reboot and unlock your bootloader. Once your Prime it has fully rebooted, press Enter to flash the clockwork. So now we'll go into our apps. And we'll be looking for that unlock tool, which is right there. And we have to agree to void our warranty. So I had to read the whole thing, click OK, and we'll have to agree once again that by unlocking the bootloader, we voided our warranty. So if you don't agree to that, don't do this. And of course, I need to enter my password real quick. This will log it in the system or whatever that you've unlocked your bootloader. So from here on out, uh, I do not have factory warranty on this device. That's something to keep in mind. So if you mess something up somewhere along the line, uh, tough luck. So as soon as that reboots, we should be able to press enter and continue with the process. And it looks like it's not giving us anything new there. Uh, no unlock pad key or anything like that to show us that we've been unlocked. So the only way they know is just by the records that they've kept, I guess. Yeah, nothing even says unlocked. Bootloader on the boot up. Okay, so as soon as this boots up, we will install Clockwork Recovery. Then we can do things like make backups and restore backups and flash custom ROMs, mods and the likes. All kinds of cool stuff. Okay, so now we're good to go. Uh, we can press enter. And now it should be flashing recovery. Just give it a few minutes. Okay, now it's rebooting. It says your Prime now has Clockwork Mod Recovery. Thanks to the Android root.mobi. To get into recovery, you have to power off the Prime. Press and hold volume up and down power until you see the Aces screen. Press volume up within five seconds to enter recovery. 
And of course, it says the ADB reboot recovery doesn't work for the Prime right now, so hopefully they're working on that. So we're going to try to boot into recovery. As soon as we get all this loaded up here, we'll try the way that it says to do it. Let's back out a little bit. Okay, so right now we just want to turn it off. And we'll try this the way that they said. Okay, so we'll go with volume down and the power at the same time. Volume down first. And then the power until we see the ACES screen. Okay, and now we should press volume up within five seconds. And if we did it right, it put us into recovery. And it looks like it's just going to boot up. I guess I did it wrong. So we'll try that again. Yep. Oh, we'll try that again. Power down. So we have to hold the volume down and power until we get to the ACES screen. Okay, so power down. I'm sorry, volume down and power until we get to the ACES screen. So keep holding it, and now we can press volume up, and that should boot us into recovery. And there you have it, Clockwork Mod Recovery on the Asus Transformer Prime. Uh, so guys, in some upcoming videos, I'm going to show you guys how to back up and restore your stock ROM as well as flash custom ROMs and other modifications to the Asus Transformer Prime. Uh, so now you guys are rooted and you're unlocked and you've got Clockwork Mod Recovery. So uh, you should be getting into some really cool fun with your Asus Transform Prime. Guys, you can check me out at droidmoderx.com for all the latest in ROMs, mods, and hacks, and also news for your Android device. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx with an E, not a 3. Subscribe to this channel where I'm going to keep you guys updated on all the latest modifications for your Android device. And be sure to give this video a big thumbs up if it helps you in any way. Thanks, guys, for watching. I'll see you in the next one.